Hey, are you stressed out and need to get rid of stress? Let's have a talk. Yes, you. So let's talk. A little bit of stress can be good, but too much stress is not good for your physical health and your well-being. I'm here to share with you five simple ways that you can use to help reduce stress. Yes. Number one, exercise. If you haven't started yet, now it's time to get the ball rolling. Exercise can help you with reducing stress. What exercise does for your body, it helps it or it prompts it to release that good, feel good hormone like um, endorphins. You know that feel good or more yeah that nice butterfly sensation yes so when you get exercising that happens to your body which can help you to feel less stress when you're going through a stressful stressful period you find that your system sub subconsciously um becomes tense especially your muscle so exercising will help in this area. Number two, try to stay organized. Organization or writing things down like get a to-do list. Um, stress tends to kick in when you feel overwhelmed. So if you become a little bit more organized, like putting things down that you need to get um, that you need to get done and number them some persons number them but tip them as you go along this will help you to stay and feel organized and you do not feel overwhelmed or um, pressured to get the task done by the end of the day and so on and so forth so for that you can get a simple organizer or a planner like this you can pick it up at your local dollar store and what you will do you will go in and you write down all the things that you need to get done in your organizer and all the tasks everything whether from um, from grocery shopping taking the children to school meal uh, meal ideas what you're having for dinner although you can have a meal plan separately but Everything that you know that you need to get done within a day, you can go ahead and write it down and it helps you to visualize what you're going through on paper. And as soon as you accomplish each, each task, you go ahead and make it, um, make it your point of duty to check mark. And that way it will help, help you to feel accomplished and you feel as if you're accomplishing something, right? On to number three. <laughs> Number three is breathing. Take the time out to stop and breathe. When you feel stress, you tend, you tend to get anxious and anxiety sets in. So when you take the time out to engage yourself in breathing exercise or deep breathing, it helps to slow your heart rate down and help to ground you focus your 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 mind your body and soul on your breathing so you stop for a few um deep breaths and you allow your body to recenter right so some persons do yoga some some persons do not but breathing exercise is one technique that can help you to slow down or to reduce stress in your life so let's go let's take a deep breath in and you're going to tell me how you feel by the end of this let it out slowly so you want to breathe in through your nostrils and you want to exhale through your mouth let's do that two more times allow your body to let go let go of what you're feeling so in through your nose and you're going to hold it for four seconds let's go
I started to feel my body releasing. And so when you take that time to breathe, it helps you to release anxiety, thus reducing your stress. Number four. Number four is take time out and pause. Sometimes we need to stop what we're doing and just pause. I'm not saying that you're a child here. <laughs> No, I'm not, and that's not what I'm implying. But just like children, right? Stress can affect our emotions and how we behave. So as, as well as our physical and mental health. So stress might make our um, so stress might make you become irritable, short-tempered, and um, easily upset and um, agitated. So when you start um, noticing that you're getting stressed, when you start noticing that you're getting stressed, it is, it is going to affect you. So what you need to do is stop for a moment. Okay, what is happening? Evaluate the situation. What is happening? And then it might be just the right time for you to step away and um, spend a few minutes just focusing on yourself. Take time out to pause, to stop, step back. You, this is a time when you might just want to go into a quiet room and just listen to some music for relaxation. Or you can find a trusted friend or colleague and just talk. Just talk. You don't even have to talk about what you're going through. But just, shh, just talk to somebody when you're going through that time and you might want to tell them how you're feeling and you will find that this helps it tends to um help you to refocus and regroup and thus relieving you of some of your stressful symptoms or just allow you to think about the, the, the problem that you're going through and look at it from a different lens. All right. The next thing I found, number five, that I find I, I continue to use. I, I found it in the past. I find it that it is working for me now is meditating. If you haven't tried it yet, you need to try it meditation mindfulness or real relaxation they are one and the same these exercises help you to um to dig deep to look um within you and they have proven to decrease and manage stress over the last two years to be exact especially since mental health has been rising nonstop, right? These are great tools for you to use to alleviate stress. Very, very good tools to use, right? Um, I have known when you're experiencing stress, sorry, my scalp is sick, so, you know, whatever is happening underneath there, it causes stress. So I find that meditating meditating helps i find that relaxation helps there are programs there are books there's there are um youtube um videos that you can use to help you with your meditation there are apps that you can download to remind you to meditate so i do know that there are other stuff out there that other persons have used to help them to reduce stress if you have tried anything different and you love to share that with us, leave it in the description box down below. Or let me know of any other um, programs or any other programs or um, activities that you have done to, that help you to relieve or to reduce your stress levels. It is very important that, that we reduce our stress level to normal because because it helps us to function function better. So when we reduce our stress level, it helps us to function better. More 
um, more efficiently, right? Ongoing stress is not um, um, good for us. It's not good for our health. It's not good for our well-being. It many of um, underlying illnesses that many persons are facing is as a result of stress. So if you can manage your stress level, then you're on your way to living a better life. You hold it to yourself. Remember to love, teach, and inspire as you go on through life. Bye for now. It's your girl, Inspiring Charm. Remember to tell your friends about my channel. If you're not a member of my membership um, family yet, please feel free to join. And I'm looking forward to seeing you on the inside. Bye.